Good day everyone, this is Joe Tompkins for Lendesk and Finmo. Today we're going to discuss how to create your MPP forms, whether you're sending out an emailed link for clients to sign up or whether you want to download the traditional form that clients can be sent via e-signing or signing in person. Let's take a look at how to do it. Let's go ahead and jump into our deal for Mr. Tassis here. On this deal, we already have an accepted offer from the lender in here. We have this one accepted. So now we're gonna to go to the compliance section. Within the compliance section, we have the accepted details that have come into the compliance section and you can edit them, of course, adjust them accordingly and save changes. Minimize this and move on to the MPP form. So right here, you're gonna have the agent assigned to the deal on your team. And then you can update. If you've made any changes on the mortgage request here, this is where you simply update the MPP. If you have a request sent in, you can cancel it right there. In the MPP to borrower section here, you can see the messages from MPP Hub. You have the email, the digital links to the borrower. So let's go ahead and click on this. And just like in the update borrower section, this is where you can come in and you can personalize this a little bit. send a copy via SMS and send it through. The borrower has now been updated and he has a link on MPP. Let's take a look at what that looks like. All right, here's the email, how it looks to the client. You have updates regarding your mortgage application. Here's the verbiage that you can change. And here's the link to go ahead and jump into NPP and complete the form. Hello, Mr. Tassis, and here we go. So it's a completely online experience for borrowers to sign up for the mortgage life insurance. The client can scroll through, and at the very bottom is get started. So there's the online version. Now let's jump back and take a look at the form. Okay, here we are in the MPP section again in compliance. So you want to download a PDF for signing, you simply just click on this. The system will now download the PDF. You can go ahead and open it when done. And there's the standard traditional MPP form to send as part of your signing package. You would go ahead and save it and then send it off for e-signing. Once completed, you're going to be able to upload the signed MPP form here. Simply choose the file where you've saved it on your system and drag it into here. If you've signed it a different way, you need to upload it here. That's it. Now you can go through and you can carry on and generate the rest of your compliance documents as needed 